Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Michael alone coming to you from Ottawa, Canada. Check it out. How's that for weather? We are Tuesday, January 15th. How do I know that? Because today, this is not the topic. Today is the most important action you can do and about looking at yourself in the mirror with one simple question. The question that's going to possibly make yourself punch yourself in the face into realizing that you are not to point fingers. You are the problem to why your business is not growing and you can address that with one simple, simple, simple question. Okay guys, who's in business here? Who's an entrepreneur? Who is selling something? Come on in guys, don't be shy. It is January 15th, oh yeah, I want to say, today, this is totally off topic, but I know the date. It's January 15th, I believe we are Tuesday today, 2018, it's 11 months today that I've been clean. Clean of a couple of things. Some of you know what I'm talking about. So today is cause for celebration, but I've been clean for 11 months of substances we'll put it that way a few of them most of you know about alcohol but a few other little bad habits today's the day Woohoo! with that being said let's look at ourselves in the mirror here one question one question to why your business is not growing it's gonna be blunt who's got a product or a service that they sell You've got to sell something if you've got a business. This is specifically for entrepreneurs in any niche. Now, I will give credit where credit is due because this one question, I actually, I'll tell you who I got it from, and I actually used to physically look at myself in the mirror and in my own eyes, and ask myself this question. And once I asked myself that question, I stopped blaming my leaders. I stopped pointing fingers and I, I addressed the problem, which was, which was me. The question is this, in the past 24 hours, how many people have you asked to take a look at your, at your business? That's it. You have to answer with a number. You have to answer with a number. You, it's zero, it's three, it's five, it's seven, or it's zero. <laughs> it's a number. The answer is a number. The answer is not a, well, I don't have time, or the answer is not, I'm going to do it soon. That's not an answer to that question. The answer must be in the form of a number. I'll repeat the question. And I'm gonna ask you right now. I should put it in the chat. Let's see, let's, let's do a little test here. How many people, no, in the past 24 hours, how many people, people, have you asked to look at your business? What's the number? Put it in the chat. I'll check out the replay and I'll chime in. Because I'm doing this quick. We're four minutes in. People don't pile in. Until, well, pile in. People don't usually come in until about 10 minutes till these things get traction. I'm not even going to do a group share on this because it's meant to be syndicated. So, ask yourself that. Ask yourself that question. In the past 24 hours, how many people have you asked to take a look at your business? I'm gonna be specific here. Not how many people have you shown your business to, and not how many targeted people have you contacted. We're gonna start with the basics. You really don't know who's into your business or not. It's better to go targeted, yes. It's better to, uh, there's a lot of better things to do. It's better to go targeted, it's better to have certain script in place 
it's better to actually just show somebody your business than not. But the most important thing is how many people of any walk of life have you asked to take a look at your business? If they would like to take a look at your business, that's it. Would you like to take a look at my business? That's it. That's, it's better to do that to 20 people in the past, in, in the 24 hours, it's better to go up to random people. <laughs> I've done it. Random friggin' people, random. It's better to go up to random people and say, would you like to take a look at my business? You have to ask them first though. Don't go sending out links. Don't do that. Better to do nothing than do that. Would, well actually it's not. But in the past 24 hours, how many people have you asked to take a look at your business? What do you think is better, doing that to 10 people in the past, in 24 hours, or using that 24 hours to finalize your script, or to know more about your product, or to study your service? No, 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 and no. The answer is a number. How many people in the past 24 hours have you asked to take a look at your business. Write that number down, write it down, and then look at yourself in the mirror and say, that's why, okay? Do it over time. Consistency is key. Do it over time. I want you to wake up in the morning. If your business is not succeeding, if you're not making sales, let's go down to the basics. Ask you, write that question down. I used to look at myself in the mirror and say that and ask myself that question. That's it guys. That's it for today. This is a question. Oh, I didn't even give props. What am I doing? This is from Todd Falcone. Todd, if you are watching, if you're watching Todd, I mean, I'm going to target this stuff like crazy. Um, it may end up in the network marketing niche, depending how I want to target my ad. If Todd Falcone is watching the replay, I want you to know, brother, you are my, you are my inspiration. You are the one, you are the single person who brought me over 10 grand per month. Mr. Falcone, Mr. Falcone, if you see this, you might. I'm pretty aggressive in my targeting. So Mr. Todd Falcone, one day I will meet you. I want you to know something. <coughs> Those, you gave me two questions, Mr. Falcone, two questions that brought me over 10 grand residually. My first 10 grand per month, four years ago, three, three, four years ago, were because of that question when I looked in the mirror, that exact question from you, and do you at all keep your options open in terms of making any money outside of what you're currently doing in the real estate profession? That's the second question, Mr. Falcone, but that's not for today's live. I did a cold call, uh, I did a cold call, uh, you could check out, here's my call to action. You could, could check out on the wealthytrainer.com in the wealth section, wealth hacks in the sales section. I go through the cold call script. So today's question is, we're gonna close it off like this. In the past 24 hours, how many people have you asked to take a look at your business? Write down the number. Look at yourself in the mirror and increase that number every day. If the number is zero because you're getting ready, that's why you're failing. Mark Lalone out. Have an awesome Tuesday. And I'll see you guys on social media. Bye-bye.